here today in St. Pete, Florida. We're going to extract a 1959 Ford retractable that's been slumbering in this garage for quite a while. Uh, why don't you take a peek at it? It's, it's been here for over 20 years. At least 20 years. I found another picture last time. You see how much stuff is stuck in there. Back on the beam. Now I was I was driving down the street and I happened to notice this little section of the bumper here, and I thought it was either a '59 Ford or a '60 Dodge. I guessed wrong and guessed it was a Dodge. Uh, anyway, the uh, people that own the car were kind enough to show me the car and, and tell me about it and tell me about their ownership of it. And uh, today we're going to go ahead and extract it from the garage. One piece at a time. Well, it's been about uh, 30, 45 minutes. We've had a little rain, which has cooled things down a bit. Uh, but not cool enough, still sweating up a storm. But we uh, went back into the shed, we uh, filled up a pickup truck load full of Ford retractable parts. I guess he had another retractable that he had totally parted out. Uh, there's all kinds of really good pieces in there. Doubles of a lot of the stainless and convertible top mechanisms and retractor assemblies, everything's in there. Anyways, we're about ready to hit the button and try and pull it up on the trailer. Uh, surprisingly, all four tires held air. As cracked up as they were, you saw them in the videos, every single one of the tires held air. So we're just gonna roll it on up and see what happens. Well, we went through the disintegrated old trunk. pick through it and figure out we got most of the stuff. But here's some of the stuff that was in there. Retractable brackets, Skyliner chrome holding pieces, a complete power window, wiring harness switches and regulators, extra Sunliner emblems, stainless steel window, door panel pieces, vent pieces, brackets. There's a whole bunch of good stuff in there. So, glad we went through it and glad we got that stuff too. Well, it's been about two hours. Finally got the car loaded up, strapped down, we're ready to head out. Uh, just gonna keep an eye out. They're still out there, they're still out in garages, they still can be found and they still can be saved. Till next time. <laughs>